Welcome to the video. The gang's all here. It is Wednesday. How have y'all been? Have y'all made it over the hump? Well, I did. My goodness. And we have quite a bit from this. Um, some great pieces. This was an amazing bag. I had to untangle. So I have some vintage for you. Look at this. I mean, amazing. There's no maker's mark. It is a pendant. Five dollars. Uh, you just don't see something like this very often. That would look great just on your dresser or wherever you're keeping your vintage collection. Or get a um, get a nice chain and resell. Let me see what this says. Nothing. Coldwater Creek. And it's just a little cluster of glass or stones or something down here. That makes me wonder what that one is right there. I'm thinking garnet, and that one might have gotten past me. But I don't know, and I'm going to sell it. $4. Now, it's a shame because we have a set here, but look. So you'll, you'll get this one, but don't think that, you know, um, it should be two when I lost it or anything. It'll just be one. Maybe you, you make something extra or make a little ring out of it or something. I don't know. People are talented. New York. It's like a, I don't know if it's, like it's I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know if it's plastic covering glass. It's glass. It's stone. I don't know. So it's going to be $3. And we have another one like that. I don't know. I think it's over there. Here's some vintage earrings. There were some pairs. Look at this. $4. Nice emerald green. Look at that. With the rhinestones, everything's there. I haven't cleaned them. They probably would clean up very nicely. This has a lot of little, whoops. I'll get to some sterling in a minute. There was a lot of sterling in this box. Now this box arrived at the house probably two months ago. So the razor blade box was more recent. Okay, this is a Talbot's. Nice and long. It'll be $5. And it has uh, beveled quartz on here. Nice gold tone. Nice and long. And it's also easy to wear. Kind of lightweight. These will go together. One of them has a little crown and the other one does not. But I'm pretty sure they're the same. Like, I think they should be worn together because look how they fit. They kind of fit like one would be seen. And look at those colors. Beautiful. Four dollars. This is Chaps. Wait. Yeah. Chaps. Three dollars. Seiko, I don't even know what to say. I didn't look up how much Seikos go for. So we're going to say $7. It probably just needs a battery, and it's in absolutely, incredibly great condition. And I hope it just it will work with a battery. Most people say that that's all they need. Um, you know, they're donated, so they're probably in working order. Or maybe they were donated when they were working. You know what I'm saying? I did work today and then five hours. By the time it got four o'clock, I was feeling it. Some stones here. Nice. Four dollars. So my bestie walked Oliver and I laid down a while. And I'm doing this, but I will not process this tonight. So 
So make sure you're making requests on the video. No need to email me if something's available. It's all on the video. I know a lot of people at, look at this ceramic. This is going to be $7. This is gorgeous. I love blue and yellow together. This is a beautiful necklace. A lot of people say, you know, email me if you're interested, but we're doing it like this. So that way, you know, it's just easier. That's the routine we got in. Wow, this is nice. Colors, $4. Look at this. I think it says Korea, but it, it says Korea, but it does have a maker's mark there. I can't make it out. $3. It's a beautiful vintage piece, like a black stone and a, and a rhinestone there. This would be Monet. Double gold strands. Well, no, it's not. It's twisted strands with rhinestones and stone or glass. Four dollars. It's a nice one. You can wear that to the office, to shopping, to church. It's kind of just elegant, nice, not real big. This is a nice crystal. Three dollars on a vintage gold tone chain. Now this one says sterling S, sterling silver. And unfortunately, I can't fix this thing here. So it's vintage sterling silver clasp. These are in pretty good shape, glass beads. And this clasp does have two rhinestones missing, $9. Speaking of some things I have to keep, y'all, I could not believe it. I, I hardly ever get Moonstone. I think that's what this is. This one's really bluish in that one. This one, not so much. I, I never get it. I certainly don't get it this large. Hanging on to that for a while. Two glass hearts, three dollars. Wait a minute, this one doesn't have the little thing there anymore. What happened? Probably broke. So now I don't know what to do here. Two dollars as is. One has this, the other one doesn't. Mm. Just now noticing that, you know, you get them together. Now these glass two dollars lever back. I have to decide if this says CJ on here. Um, if it's amber and turquoise, I'm not sure. Now somebody put this on there on their own. Uh, yeah, black light. I don't feel like getting it out. You know what I mean? I don't think it's amber, but I don't know. Five dollars. Has some tiger eye. Here is a very interesting agate with um, some kind of leather, alligator or snake skin. And it's an agate. Kind of hard to see. It's got the line swirly and then they put something, somebody made this. Now there's a issue is this comes apart. It may be broken, I'm not sure. Well, now I can't get it apart, so that's good. 
It's going to be $5. Sterling, I will sell it. Let me see what it says. I forgot. Um, Sri Lanka MWS925. It does not stick to a magnet, so I assume all of the chains are 925. It'll be 1414 with Mother of Pearl. Hi, Minka. This, like, fits in the middle there, and there's two chains. And I assume that they're both 925. Chico's. Chico's. Three dollars. It's kind of a neat olive green. Army green. Now this is Germany, and I'm keeping it just because this Shell seems older. I don't know why. Just thought I'd hang on. This is vintage. So it's put on a Germany chain, but this is vintage. So I'm hanging on to that. Oh, here's this that'll go with it. Just one again. I'm looking for it in here. There it is. Let's go ahead and, and um, sell this for eighteen one eight. It's sterling. Let me just make sure. Wait a minute. The chain is not. Is that right? Hmm. The fleur de lis is stamped 925. Now, that's marcasite. And then this, it has a little Well, it does not stick to a magnet, but I don't I don't see a mark for the clasp, so we're just going to assume it is not sterling, but the pendant is, so we'll come down to um, $12. If you know what a dime is, there's the size. We got that beautiful single cuff link. I got, I don't know if I want to sell this. I guess I will. It'll be $7. It's just magnificent. I got one of these, which I like. It's not a real coin, obviously, but I like it. So got those and got this 925 snake earring and this is I'm not sure let me see I think that says it says sterling so this is older look at all this Hanging on to that. This one as well. This 925 Italy. Has a shinier look like a rhodonite coat. Let me see if I'm going to sell this one. I'm going to sell this one, but it's gorgeous. It'll be 1818. And the chain is sterling. And this is sterling right there. And look at that. It is gorgeous. Good luck on that one. I know a lot of people are going to be like, ooh, I'd like to have that. I think this is garnet. So it's sterling and garnet. 
and it has a nice pendant that's a lock so I'm gonna have to hang on to that this one I will sell let me make sure iridescent small and it says 925 and all that right there and um, nice thin understated you know not it's small but it's got a lot of sterling so that'll be 18 as well 1 8 this one I will sell as well this will be the last sterling I will sell it's nice um, I believe that's lab created amethyst 925CR wait let me make sure that says 925 it's upside down I'm not sure hold on here it is right here no it's not it's IBBCN that tricked me this is not sterling I don't think but anyway it's pretty so it'll be five dollars it is not sterling as far as I know then I got to looking at this rosary it's not for sale I mean yeah rosary I was like that is just it looks real looks real and then I looked there it is look how small this is right there sterling it's just beautiful now this has come apart but it, it'll go back together and so all of that must be sterling with crystal and it's not for sale nice single sterling earring with a pearl sterling earring single with I don't think their diamonds are going to be rhinestones. Hanging on to that. And I'm hanging on to this. Well, actually, let's sell it. Whew. 13. Carnelian agate. Vintage. $6. No name. But my gosh, I... I put it in my stash and then took it out and put it back over and over you've got this beautiful um, interlaced part this is gorgeous this is stunning it's just breathtaking more vintage matching bracelet no name here's where it goes together small necklace kind of a coppery color this will be eight dollars together it has a, a there it is yeah that was nice listener l-i-s-n-e-r right there listener I'm trying to keep the prices low so you can resell look at this class people Wow, that'll take your breath away, too. Look at that. There's that. It's just gorgeous. Um, Six dollars. What else? There's a beautiful cross right here. Four dollars. No name. Some rhinestones. I don't have chains for them this has a like a crystal or something three dollars vintage this one is Sarah Cove it is a pendant 
Look how gorgeous. I think it's a pendant. Four dollars. This is Monet. Let me make sure. Yeah. And, uh-oh, it just broke at the top. Oh, my gosh. That was delicate. I mean, I barely touched it. So, it's going to go in the um, vintage. This is missing one rhinestone. And so, a lot of this is... Um, and Terry told me that these were napkin rings by Monet. So some of this, most of this is broken, so used for parts or repair. Vintage. Both of these are in here. This just needs a, it's by Lancome, I think. I think they're both in there. Yeah. It needs just the earring back. Look at that blue. Oh, that's just a single earring there. So this will be $10. It's for crafting or repair. Vintage. Beautiful glass, pink glass with gold tone. Has two class. I guess you can get them on there real good. There you go. And how about six dollars for that one it is pretty nice and long with the gold tone goes really well with that pink nice rhinestone disc two of them i think it, they're all there no name three dollars there's the back of it Claire's some glass I believe like a southwest small and then a, a little dangle three dollars that one dangles down no name but it's a beautiful color four dollars beautiful color Boy, and this stuff was tangled because of the way they pack it up, but that's okay. There was no razor blade this time. Nine West. Blue glass, teal glass. One's missing. And I don't have it. Or do I? Yes, I do. I don't know that that will stay in there. $4. You might want to touch it up with a little glue. More vintage. This piece had a lot of things tangled on it. This is a nice piece. There's the clasp, kind of like a the pearl. And it's going to be $5. Beautiful vintage. Great piece there. This says Jenny, J-E-N-N-I, with maybe Marcusite in there. $3. Vintage. This is like a plastic laid into that brownish red look at that five dollars trying to keep these prices low that would be 18 on to 24 on a an Etsy or something like that at least I think it would Wait, there was a nice ring. If I can find it, we'll just end with that. Tell you what, on the earrings, they'll just go for free with this. 
and well, just whatever I said the price was, that's going to all go together. Tree. $3. Glass, raised dome, nice little silver tone chain. Tree of Life. I believe they're all here. Four dollars. Super nice. Um, I want to end on the ring, but... We had one nice ring. Linda E. got that. Good job, Linda E. And... We have another, oh, here it is. I think it'll be $6 like the last one. Almost eight from what I can tell. Or maybe that's an eight. Good luck on that one beautiful okay well I'm gonna not I'm gonna you know go rest lay down go to bed and um, Billy Bob did not get any gold out of this this time the pearls these are the pearls that didn't sell last time so we have pink and they're kind of different shaped they're not your all round and then like a champagneish orangish and a white that's smaller two four six um let's just say eight dollars for those three nice stretchy wear them all together looks really nice they are pearls um this is the only one i really like this piece it's copper And that might be, you know, cast aluminum or something. But we're going to say $3. It's by itself. Clip on. And we'll stop. <laughs> How about some rhinestone? Needs to be cleaned. They're all there. I think it's vintage. Five dollars needs to be clean. Might be something going on in there. See that white stuff? Maybe somebody cleaned it. I just don't want to get water out and start messing with the glue. And I don't really know how to clean that type of thing. There was one more rhinestone in here, about the same style. I mean, different style, but same age, I thought. Maybe it's in this pile. So we have two more piles to go through still. Lots of nice pieces. Here's another vintage. This was a really great box. Japan. Uh, $5. Look at that. They go inside of each other. And I believe they're glass. Well, just have to be patient on the rhinestone. I wanted to get it out in front of, you know, whoever might be interested in that one, and you can get try to get both of them. There it is. Somebody was probably seeing it this whole time, and I was driving you crazy. This is very nice. I don't know. I think it's all there. I don't know. 
A lot of times when I untangle, I'm not like going over it with the fine tooth comb at all. I'm just separating it. So there's that drop. And then it closes off like that. Uh, Five dollars. Thank you. God bless. Have a wonderful evening.